Hello everybody, welcome back to more into the Gungeon. Beat the Gungeon! We're playing the Gunslinger! Rita, play the Gunslinger, okay! Don't have to, you don't have to work hard to convince me to play the Gunslinger, right? I, I'm cool with it right now. We've gone through the phases. We've arrived back on, uh, on Adoration. I like the character a lot, it's just a, it's a nice break day, I mean... Now that we, you know, really need a break day, it's just, it's nice, you know? I ain't gonna complain here, I'll, I'll do this. I don't know if we're going or not, I don't know if I feel like going, I don't know what the, uh, the chest situation's gonna be like. But a lot of times, I just like to open up a chest right away because... The bad tier chests aren't bad for a gunslinger. In fact, there's a lot of, I, I mean, we say it every time we play them, there's a lot of brown chest guns that become better than, like, the S tier guns. Because it's like, all the, all like the S tier guns and everything, the really high tier guns, they, uh, there's not really a lot of synergies for them that make them that much crazier or better, because they're like, they're already really good. They're just like, these don't need to be better. But, um, all the, yeah, all the brown chest guns, there's a bunch of them that just... And they give them a lot of synergies, and that's the thing, is the Gunslinger, you know, getting all the synergies. They put in, like, two or three synergies for a lot of the brown chest guns that really make them, uh, you know, they, they, they bring them up to, like, the A tier level. And then for most of those guns, if you get a couple of those that bring them up to the A tier level, they transcend the S tier, you know? Like, the Cactus is just, it's just busted. The Flare Gun, it's just busted. I would say they're they're above S tier. <laughs> it's what it feels like. Science cannon. I don't even remember if it has any synergies, to be honest. C Ford's Dukish. Don't need it. It's not worth our money when we could save it for uh you know for rat key or something. Now that we you know once again now that we need to get the rat key at, uh, or uh, the the rat stuff or anything. It's just, it's, you know. It just, it's nice to go. It's a, it's a fun way to add extra floor without adding too much extra time. It's, there's a reason why it's my favorite alt floor, and that's really what it is. It, ooh, we open these. Okay, well, it ain't bad. I was... Oh, oh my God. <gasps> Owl! Mr. Owl! Hey, that's amazing. That's amazing. Okay, so what we're we're like basically done, basically, right? Basically done, basically. Was that the last item? We've picked up every passive except for except for the one that we don't have, which is not even necessary for, uh, for the old, whatchamacallit, for the old finished gun. That being said, we'll, we'll do something for it. We'll do something for it. We'll, we'll, we'll get it. We'll make it happen. Oh, we flipped the table. Oop. Hopefully we get, like, I don't know, gunslinger, or not gunslinger. Uh, Gallingo. Gallingo fight with the tables, couldn't. And we can actually utilize our good stuff. Oregoni is super good with the synergies. It's not like it ain't busted, but it's good. It's really good. Would you look at that? Oh, oh, okay. Flip it before he breaks it. Man, I actually really hate this room layout. For the Galangal. It's just, it really. There we go, there we go. You wanna be in the middle. You want him to not be in the middle, and you wanna be in the middle. Otherwise, it's just an annoying. It's a pretty annoying fight. Wow. Okay. It's good, it's good. It, I'd, I'd say that that brings it, that room layout specifically brings that fight from. You know, uh, not too bad to maybe the to the worst. Like the room layout with the pillars, I feel like the Gatling Gull is easier than uh, you know easier than the Trigger Twins or something. 
Not that the Trigger Twins are really, I don't find them hard, but like, you know, comparing apples to other apples, <laughs> the first floors, you know, comparing the first floor stuff, it's just, uh, but when you throw in that room layout, I think it makes it the hardest first floor boss. It's just, it really shows you how much the room layout and like how much space you have to move around plays into uh, how hard bosses are. Like, the high, uh, high priest. Oh. Boy, oh boy. He, uh, he, he sucks, obviously. He's like, he's probably one of my least, least favorite bosses difficulty wise to fight. Uh, but you throw in the, he does have a room variation. He's one of the few that actually does. Uh, you throw in the one where he has the pillars on the four corners and it's, it's noticeably not nearly as bad. You get stuff to hide behind for the whole dang time. It's really not nearly as bad. No boss damage cap should make this an easy peasy fight. Thank you very much. And we get the ammo back. Good deal. I'm not going to use the key yet. I will do that, though. Poiple, who's here? Oh. What does the Poiple mean? What does the Poiple mean? I'm a blank. I'm a blank because the Poiple. What is up with that? What is up with that? I'm confused. I'm checking. Checking around. Because now I'm just confused. Whenever I see something like really weird like that, I'm like, we gotta look around. Because this has gotta be the floor where the high dragon fire is, obviously. But actually, I, I feel like it can only be... Well, there's purple right here that that doesn't mean anything, I don't think. I feel like it can only be on one floor, and I can't remember which one. Table tech money, okay. I can't remember if it's floor two or floor three. Did I just walk into that one? The sun is, is the sun is moving up, so I'm, I'm I'm running out of my the time where I can claim glare. But boy, I definitely fell blind right there. That one was my bad entirely. I saw that and was willingly deciding to to jump myself in. All right. Good deal. All right, all right. You got a key. Don't you hit me, I'm busy. Don't hit me, I'm busy. Oh my goodness. Boy. <laughs> the two of those just went right into the side. Hey, it's been a hot moment in the video. I feel like it's time to plug something. It's super relevant to you, I promise, I promise. Uh, and that's the fact that the other day, we did a, uh, what do I open? I'm gonna open that. We did a Gungeon stream where we did a run that was over two hours long. Involved two sets of clones and a billion super space turtles. And it is going to be live on my second channel today. Rito does games at 4 p.m. Central. So if you're watching this past 4 p.m. Central. Oh, it, effectively, it's going to be, you know, what? What is that? It's three hours after the video comes out live this video comes out live. Uh, it's gonna be over there. So you can go and you can even just, uh, if you're watching before that, you can, oop, I just tabbed out. I tabbed out to go subscribe to Rio Does Games. No. Oop, hey. I got stoned. Uh, but, yeah, you can go subscribe so that when it comes out, you're all, all notified and stuff. It was a, it was a doozy. It was insane. It was very, very, very crazy. And very, very fun. Highly recommended that you check it out. In addition, I also have Demon Crawl over there, which is, a, you know, roguelike Minesweeper. Got, like, got three episodes of that out over there. Oh, Mama Sita! Okay! I feel like we have stuff we can sell. We could sell the sponge. I don't... Eh. 
Eh. I don't need to sell anything. Silver bullets are fun. If we could get cursed bullets, they're really fun. That would be great. The sun is finally moving up. Okay. All right. There's only like 10% glare on my screen. So now every hit I have to take entire credit for. And therefore, as a result, I'm not going to get hit for the rest of the game. Obviously. If we get hit. If we get hit. There's some other reason. There has to be. Look at that. The silver bullet lanterns are kind of... Kind of slick looking, huh? But, uh, yeah, doing the big old bonus damage to jammed enemies means that if we get a bunch of curse, doesn't really matter. It's, it's weird. It's, silver bullets make my relationship with curse a strange one. Oops. Because it makes you do, okay, obviously glare. <laughs> Uh, it makes it so you do more damage to jammed enemies than you, like, you kill them faster than you kill normal enemies. Which is weird. But also, they, they're still scarier than a normal enemy. Like, they're not, you know, they still move faster and do more damage to you. So it's not like it's, you know, just a no-brainer. You want, obviously want curse. Of course you want curse. But it also does, I believe, like 10 or 15%. You do 10 or 15% extra damage to bosses just by having it. They don't have to even be jammed. They're just all bosses. Table tech money is flipping over all of our tables at the same time. So we can't fully utilize the uh, the table flips for table six. It's tight like I'd like, but you know, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. I don't think I feel like ditching either of them. Not that I even have the option at this exact moment. Do not be. Okay. I just had a feeling. Okay. Yeah, not that we have the option to sell anything right now. But if, if we get the option, which we will, you know. Maybe on floor four, we'll sell Table Tech money. It probably will have outlasted its usefulness by then anyways. I feel like, you know. Stocks, dude can get all the money and then get out get all the money and sell oh yeah all right jar bees into the pit we didn't like those bees they've been bad bees they've been bad bees well, i kind of like uh, that was not on purpose missing but i kind of like missing in a way just to like see the bees coming from behind and get him like I don't know it was not an on purpose miss though but that one is it, you want to hit with the shot like <laughs> it's there's not a good reason to to miss <laughs> other than oh my god I hate how fast you are okay annoying duel and we stunned him though there's not a good reason this. Whoop. Juke. Okay, finally, rat roomation. We gotta get a key. Good news is we got the shop right there. We got 55 shells. We can totally do it. All we need is to get there. Oh my god, it lasts so long. It lasts so long. When I flip, I because if you flip a room full of tables, it flips the one, and then it, it does not flip them all at the exact same time. There's a little bit of a delay between it, creating some uh, some extended table tech site. If your table tech site lasts for longer than four hours, please consult a doctor. Son of a gun. <laughs> All right. I want keys. Oh, boy. Okay. I was going to say, if that, I'd be a little disappointed if that was, uh, was Flint. I'm glad it's not. 
50 shells, 50 casings for the uh, the barrel. It's a, it's a pretty good deal. Especially, I mean, the synergies with it are not too shabby. You get one fish, two fish. The one fish, two fish, Cory Kenshin fish. Synergy mixed with the um, fish in a barrel synergy. Hip, hip, hip. Good deal. Three, two, one. Bees. Hey, thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, God. It's too early in the morning for this. It's far too early in the morning for this. Oh, wait. This is the one that's easy. This is the one that's really easy. I always, I always get tripped up with the moving platform ones. Oh, uh, here's the real question. Which one should we open? Because we are the gunslinger. I'll open up the green. I've made a poor decision. I immediately regret my actions. Uh oh. We also don't have blanks. We miss, we miss. Oh my god. You see that glare moving around my screen? <laughs> a little circular glare right down there. What's everyone's favorite uh, excuse to explain why why they did bad when you when you just did bad in a game? What's your what's your favorite non-real excuse? I like uh, I like saying that Mercury's in retrograde. So we do have the rat stuff. All right. Is there, okay, there is a banana synergy. <laughs> this is <isn't laughs> all right. Mercury's in retrograde. That's why I thought, I thought that that was the rat door in my head. <laughs> That's why Mer <laughs> It's because Mercury's in retrograde. Otherwise, I would wouldn't have been so stupid as to jump in that pit. Man, oh man. Man, oh man. Episode sixty nine, huh? All right, let's banana them. Up, up, down, right, down, up. I mean, it, based off of how today's going, I'm going to get this wrong. So let's let's pay attention. Extremely close. Up. Next is up. Next is up. Next is up. Oh god, so many jam boys. Banana blast! Banana blast! Oh my. This room is taking so long that I... That's that's when I run into issues with uh, going the correct direction. It's when the rooms start to take so long that I forget where I was. So up, up. Next is down. Next is down. Stand by the door that I'm supposed to go to. Next is right. Oh boy. Oh boy. There's a lot happening in this room. I never give this room credit for being so annoying. <laughs> Next is down. Oh, banana blast! It lasts so long! Next is down. And then up, and we're done. Oh, honestly, just switch these. Man, we just we just don't have the uh, <laughs> we don't there <laughs> we just don't have the ammo or damage to really take those out quickly. Uh, honestly, I'd say a little bit of that, a little bit of that. I think this will give us, and we actually have the perfect situation to do the rat heart cheese. Push, 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 push. It's annoying, but uh, 
Actually, you know what? The owl is going to push it out. The owl is going to push it all out. With the blank effect. That's okay. We'll do this in case it doesn't. But it 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 will. Owls, owl will say no. I'll say no. Push it up, push it up, push it up. Bang it up, bang it up, bang it up. Okay. If we maybe we get all the way up here, I see. But here's the thing: muscle memory. It's a very real thing, you know. And I feel like I have my muscle memory set to the uh, to the bottom. The bottom middle is where I always fight this. It's, you'll notice that's always where I slowly move myself to. Is in the bottom middle. Uh-oh. We might have done it. But here's the thing. <laughs> we didn't get in anyway, so we'll never know. All right, for science. For science. Let's see. Did I do it? I did it. Okay. Good deal. Just for science. It's called research, sweetie. Look it up. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna do this. For this phase. Wait. It's the... It's the cult... It's not the cultist. I thought that it was... Why did I think it was the cultist <laughs> that he used? I thought that he like kidnapped the cultist and made the cultist do it for some reason. But I guess this whole time it's just been the, the normal red gunjurer. It's a pretty decent gun for this situation. One, two, a three! Mr. Owl, have some bees. I love the sponge right now. So we can just walk through the fire. Bomp. Three, two, one, bees. Bomp. All right. Pretty smooth boss fight there. It really shows you. Yeah, this this run is it's pretty darn good. We just need ammo. Excuse me, sir. Robotos! We're broken. Oop, dang it. Get out of here. Ooh! There's some good stuff there. Chaos amulet with the freaking owl! Let's go! Excuse me. Get out! <laughs> we keep, like, we keep baiting him. Oh, come on. Unity. No problem with that. Don't think so, my guy. Uh, what? Illegal. Wait, that's illegal. Come on. Come on, another time. Try it again. Try it again, I dare you! Get out of here! I don't want to see your dirty, rotten rat face ever again! Stunted on. Get stunted on. Sorry, Jarabee's singularity is just going to be a bit better. It does eat some of our money, but that's fine. Robo Toes, strongest item in the game. <laughs> Obviously. And now we got Robo Toes too. It's like, uh, oh my god. We can go up there. We can get ourselves some extra, some rat toes to go with it. All right. And we're off. Goodbye. Gotta love it. Mr. Owl. Mr. Chaos Owl. Come on. Blank. I need to see. Do you, you, uh, you're getting hit by the bullets, my friend. Oh, my God. It's so busted. The owl is like... 
Whenever people ask me, well, Rita, what's your favorite familiar? I usually say Super Space Turtle. And honestly, it probably is just like thematically. But man, the owl can just get really memey. You know? You just like. Come on. Go, Mr. Owl. Look at that. Oh. Oh. It just. Wow. It just do a lot, you know? It just do a lot, you know? Give me Baby Good Mimic. I know that you can have two owls. I don't know if... I don't know how they really interact together, though. Like, I, I know they can both do the blank effect, which I imagine would do the eff it would do the effect twice, which, you know, like... <sighs> Heavy bullets I'm actually kind of neutral on. But with the with planes, you know, sure. They're, they're starting to actually look like uh, some... Some actual aircrafts now. Look at that. But, I mean, I think that, if, yeah, if we had two owl effects going on with Chaos Bullet, since it does the random effects, I would imagine it would it would roll it twice, you know, right? I think it would roll it twice. You roll it once, and you roll it twice. There we go. Oh, I'm going to come and get you. What did I get hit by? It must have been the laser. Or oh, you know what? Maybe it was a. Sp maybe it was one of the uh, these guys. Ah. Maybe it was one of them. Oh, we could cleanse ourselves. Do we want to? Do we want to cleanse ourselves? We have s silver bullets. I don't really care if we cleanse ourselves. We get this so rarely. Why does it just have to show up today? The day where it's like, I really don't want to. How much does it even cost? Five. So we clearly have, what, one curse? What are we cursed by? Shelton key? Shelton key? Is that it? That's it? Well... Don't need to buy any keys, obviously. We got because we got the shelter key. Yep, up, 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 suppressive fire, banana suppressive fire. Dang, it lasts for ages. When there's there's just two tables in the room and it lasts for ages. Give me blank bullets. I would like to ruin their days. Give give me blank bullets. I do. I kind of. I like the slow-moving banana spread. Banana spread. Oh. Boy, oh boy. Get wrecked. Say goodnight. Yeah, this is, uh, this build's... It's starting to... It's, it's, it's cooking. It's cooking good. Banana blast! Oh my god, look how slow. When it splits off, it goes back to normal speed because those are not affected by the heavy bullets, but... Look, at it's just like... It's just moseying along. Follow the bouncing banana. Uh-oh, here we go. We're gonna last forever. Have all of these. Actually, there. Let them float around for a second, and then turn around and get them. The heavy bullets lets us uh, get them to uh, to hit targets more often. It seems like. Ooh. What synergies that give us? Heavy heavy stance since it's a shotgun. Heavy stances. All right, so we can throw that behind them, and all the shots get super absorbed into them. All right. And yeah, 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 yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Yeah, put that down against my better judgment. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Because it absorbs all your bullets too, you know. So you, uh oh, oh boy. So you want it to be behind the wall monger. Same with like second phase of the lich or high dragon. Oh, 
boom, 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 you know what, sure. Why not? Why not? Oh, you know what, maybe why not is because I don't really know what else I want to sell. I can sell hard synthesizer. It's worth, it's worth a lot of money, and I don't really need it. Huh. I'm actually gonna sell the stinger because it's it's also same same reason. It's worth us a, a decent amount of money, and I don't really need it. And as a result, I'll get that. Hooray! <laughs> Oops. Bump, 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 bump. Slow moving banana. And they really just they just go freaking poop. Oh, whoop. Fail. Oh, look at that. Look at that. You gotta love the poison blast. I wanna put this top hat on. I wanna put this hat on my hat. The way that it's positioned reminds me exactly and the like the shine to it reminds me exactly of the Monopoly top hat piece. Which Monopoly piece did you use? And what you say will will also make it clear what age you are, or at the very least, how old your game of Monopoly is. It does. It does. It clarifies. Oh, I mean, didn't they? What they? They got rid of a bunch of the like the weird ones, right? Like. I mean, they, they've, there's been weird ones. I know that, like, the one that I played, they already changed the pieces. Like, I uh, I would always want to be the dog. And I know the dog was not always a piece in Monopoly. But they still have the... They gotta have the top hat still, right? They gotta. That's The top hat's timeless. They, I bet you they got rid of the thimble, though, right? What do, how, do they, how do they line up... How do they pick a freaking top hat... A boot, a thimble, an iron. How they? Why did they land on these? Johnny Monopoly was just looking around his house and was like, "Oh shoot, Greg, we forgot to make, we forgot to design the pieces." <laughs> Quick, they need the ideas by eleven. Oh, but Johnny Monopoly, it's ten thirty-five. I know. Quick. What do we have? Uh, uh, boot, boot. Great, great, great. What else? Uh, uh, iron? Great, great, great. Fantastic. That'll work perfect. And then they, like, they added the dog later. Like, the dog, I don't know. The dog, I'm like, okay, I get it. Is it just because it's a living, like a living thing? Is that why it feels like it makes more sense? And then they they added a cat recently too, didn't they? And obviously, I'm not talking like uh, I uh, I always wanted to. I was Bulbasaur when we were playing Pokemon Monopoly. We're not talking about that. It's a different story entirely. Different story entirely. You can answer that if you've only played. Uh, oh, man, it's thinking black hole. If you only played uh, Offshoot. Like licensed Monopoly. That's fine too. You can say that too. If that's the only one you played. I'm curious. What piece were you? And what does it say about you? <laughs> Whoop. You'll regret this. He could have said the same. Why did he say you regret this? But he says you'll pay for this. Doink. All right. Oh. It's a pretty good gun with the gunslinger, isn't it? It's becomes pretty decent. It does a does a freezy freeze. Boom. We get to put down a little army of them. We shoot. There's more than one there, right? Yeah. Yeah. Each time we shot it, we shot out two. It's just they were standing right by each other. Where did that fire come from? Doesn't really 
matter. Doesn't really matter. Bip, 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 bip. And goodbye to all my friends. <laughs> Look at that, we're actually using them as a bullet. For the first time. I mean, you, yes, you use them as a bullet, as like a super slow moving bullet anyway. Uh oh, this is gonna take forever. But you know what? We can use that as an advantage to get extra shots in this room. But the fact that they're slow moving is actually pretty beneficial too, because it means they'll be on the screen shooting bullets out longer. Because so they won't reach their destination. Oh. oh, I'm coming to get you! <laughs> oh, that is... That's a horror movie right there. That is a horror movie. Don't steal my planes. Don't you steal my planes. Alright. Here we go, same deal. <clears throat> that's, I don't know, that's just hilarious to me for <laughs> some reason. I wonder, like, there's gotta be games out there that really, like... You know that, that feeling that you get while you're playing a horror game? Oop. That you get while you're playing a horror game and you're like, oh man, uh... Uh, that guy is I'm terrified of Mr. X. That guy's gonna, he's gonna come, come give it to me. He's gonna bop me good. And you get all freaked out. I wonder, like, how many games are out there that make you feel like that against NPCs, you know? Because I, I know there's, like, I, obviously there's Dead by Daylight, the Friday the 13th, uh, Luigi's Ghost Mansion. No, I'm not talking about Luigi's Mansion. Yes, I'm talking about the mini game in Nintendo Land for Wii U. God rest its soul. Uh, Luigi's Ghost Mansion. Like those asymmetric, uh, multiplayer games where one person's kind of the monster. I'm talking like, there's gotta be, there's probably some out there that make you feel like that. But, like, you know, against NPCs. I guess the only thing I can think of is like Hitman. It's kind of, kind of like that, I guess. No! Why must I be OP? I wish this gave you Rubenstein. Rhapsody does too, I'm sure. It doesn't have any synergies on its own, though, huh? Rubenstein. We've already got it now. If, like, I'd, I would probably, like, go in and munch a bunch of stuff. I'd munch, munch a bunch if I didn't have it yet. Bye, guys. We do lose money if it gets absorbed into the black hole, as far as I'm aware. However, we have $330 and infinite keys. I do not mind running out of money. We still have 121 and we bought freaking everything. You know what? This is actually a banger. Oops. This is actually a banger. Yep, 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 yep. Hey, oh. Bip, 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 bip. Look at their little faces. They're going, ah! Just shooting out a bunch of restless souls. Like, they, they've been spending eternity in, in the Hades. And we're just releasing them. Only to be used as a weapon. And then they go poof. Gone forever. Poof. Yoink. I mean, but yeah, this this is one of those ones that's like, with all the synergies, it's... With all the fixins, it's super good. This is a weird run for the... Oh, what's happening there? It's a weird run for the gunslinger because... Yeah, I'm trying to make it happen. Wow, look at that. What is that? happening there I can reproduce it uh, but 
It's, one of the, it's a weird run because we would get most of these synergies anyways. That's the weird thing about today. A lot of these synergies, we actually just would have gotten <laughs> just by playing the game normally. Okay. You know what? I want to do this. Just want to see it. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. I want the black hole to go away now. I feel like we'll probably hit like the damage cap with this, won't we? With that slowly they're moving. We don't need to fire them over there. They'll, they'll just go over there. Also, they're frozen. They're, oh, they're dissipating. Shoot. I forgot they dissipate. We actually want them to be, like, right here. Because we do want them to eventually hit. They do damage when they hit the boss, too. This is just... I mean, this is just better. They do damage when they hit the enemy. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, thank you. No, thank you very much. I'm spelling my name. My name is... L. Apparently. You know, like from Death Note. Oh no. Uh no, no! That's illegal. So tilted. Tilted. Oh. Straight to hell. Okay. I mean, we've got good stuff. Obviously. And we are the gunslinger. Obviously. But I think, um... I think my favorite thing we have is the owl the owl with chaos ammo it's just i don't know it's just really nice it's satisfying beep bop beep bop beep bop body don't stop <laughs> decision paralysis who to shoot who to shoot Does the black hole from Singularity home in? Seemed like it did there for a hot moment. I mean, just with Unity and heavy bullets, everything is slow moving, but dang, it is, it's hitting pretty hard. It's hitting pretty hard. Beep, 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 beep. We don't even need to aim at them. Oh, maybe we should, though. <laughs> We're bouncing them around. We're bouncing them around, causing a little bit of a problem. Kill the little summoner first. Okay. Ooh, thank you very much. Sure. Why not? It's actually, like, not too bad with all the synergies. The slow-moving bullet situation is kind of interesting. Oh! <laughs> oh. I just realized we've gotten zero totem pole guys today. Zero. Okay, well, look at that. Look at that. There will be one in here. At least there's supposed to. Actually, this is an alternate version. There might not be. I think that's one. It's a baby totem pole in the wild. There we go. Wow. Actually good, though. 
Who'd have thought? I kind of want to put down... I don't know. I want to put down the uh, spacebar item and, and bop somebody by like having all the shots absorb in on them. I feel like it might do a lot of damage, actually. It might be surprisingly good. Right now, I mean, surprisingly good is a perfect example of what's going on right now. It's like, it's impressing me. It's doing good, it's doing good. And I think that, uh, I mean, I think Unity is helping it a lot. Like, the, the damage increase from all the other shots, or all the other guns, I think are totally helping it out. Oh, he made it! The courage! The courage on that man! Have a banana. Have a banana. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> Didn't even. Didn't even. Can you steal these? Nope. Full HP. Don't mind if I do. We're going to run out of ammo before I get to test out my thing. So I'm going to... I'm going to say nah. I'm going to do a switch on it. Oop. I goofed it. Nobody will uh, enter my corner. Nope. Nope. I will not even move to assert dominance upon them. Oh, it's a big room. It's fun to watch that in slow-mo. Oh, it's so fun to watch that in slow-mo. Everyone we kill turns into ghosties. And that's that. What else do we have? We, we like, really are running out of ammo. Man, our, our ammo economy today is just... Boy, it's been the pits, huh? Like, I... I never really have ammo issues on the gunslinger. That just crossed my mind. That's interesting. But I mean, yeah, like look at all these guns. This is, this is all the stuff we got left. Yoink. Right. This is definitely our final intersection. But dang, I'd like some ammo. Banana blast! Triple bananas slowly bouncing to their target. Triple bananas slowly bouncing to their target. Okay. Whenever this phase shows up, there's only one enemy that really matters. The rest, you know. These guys are, once you figure them out, they are really, they're really just like a room hazard more than an enemy, really. But then again, aren't enemies just technically room hazards? Aren't they all? Aren't they all? Thank you very much. I did lose that. Okay. Wow. <laughs> the ammo here is Duke Garbo. This may be one of the weaker... Oh, my God. My keyboard. Did a goop. Uh, this may be one of the weaker gunslinger runs we've had. I do want to go up and try out my silencer thing as soon as this move is over. If you hit me, it's fine. I just don't want to mess it up. Oh! Oh! It works so well! We're going to run out of ammo, but dang! It works so well. I mean, we're doing roughly the same amount of damage anyway. We're hitting the 
damage cap with silencer. Dang. Who'd have thunk? Who'd have thunk? All right. Bloop. I mean, we can do this obviously with our standard if we really needed to. Uh, we might have. Okay, I was gonna say we might have made this harder for ourselves when that ends, but we did not. We are all good. Mr. Owl is gonna give me a nice, easy, breezy time. And let's just save our space bar. Here, let's start throwing some guns. <laughs> I love how they just keep slowly spinning. It makes no sense. Empty. Have my gun? Nope. Man. Why did, did that... Why did that... Why is it going backwards? Oh my god, we... <laughs> We hit the black hole super far away. That is goofy. That is straight up goofy. Mr. Iowa, do something. Thank you. Thank you very much. You are consistently being a doinkus. I will eat all my bananas. Fine. I'll eat my dang potassium. I'll eat my dang potassium. I've been, <laughs> I've been using my standard instead of it. Get him. Get him. I think my owl is doing more damage with the blank effects than the banana is doing. Eat your potassium. No, I missed. It. Do you not have more? You do have more. Ha! Ha! Oh, I said. Ha! 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 Nope, don't use a gun. Pick it up. Pick it all up. Play ring around the rosy. There we go. We will get there slowly but surely. Why is this big? Oop. Uh, no. <laughs> get ready. Potassium blast. I didn't work. All right, he's just gonna die because of the poison from the owl. <laughs> Oh, jeez, la freaking wheeze. What a weird run. Thank you, Mr. Owl. But that. It's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching episode 69. Event to the gun gen. Beat the gun gen. Subscribe if you have not for more. Enter the gungeon and roguelike content. Every day, baby. Every single day. Extra special thank you to Ounce Throwbo and DX for supporting on Patreon at the Go Team Gungeon Tier. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.